What's up, social media? Welcome to the Secular Connections Health and Wellness blog. This blog can be found at anywhere you view or listen to blogs. Also, it can be found on YouTube. So check out the YouTube channel. If you're on the road, check out the blog at Spotify and wherever you uh do your blog listen to blogs this is the health and wellness channel so if you like this kind of information welcome to the channel if you're on youtube hit that like button subscribe share the video and that way and also hit the notification that way you can stay and stay tuned when we uh download uh, or upload another video so Without further ado, we're going to talk about barriers, the effects of barriers on your health. For simply today, we're going to talk about black barriers. If you want to know the effect of strawberries and blueberries, check out our video on that. on YouTube. A link will be in the description box, so check that out. But first, let's look at berries. What are berries in general? Berries are any small fleshy fruit, especially, and especially if that fleshy fruit is edible. Raspberries, blackberries, strawberries, for example, are not true berries, but are aggregate fruits. But we're including those in our discussion of berries, even though they are not true berries. Fruits that consist of a number of smaller fruits are berries. Cranberries and blueberries are however true botanical berries. A berry is a small, puppy, and often edible fruit. Typically, berries are juicy, rounded, brightly colored, sweet, sour, or tart. They do not have a stronger pit, although many pips of seeds may be present. And that's from Wikipedia. As I said, our main discussion today is dealing with blackberries. So let's get into blackberries. We're going to look at an overview of blackberries. We're going to look at the, the, the good positive effects of blackberries. Blackberries offer many health benefits, including one number one. They're full of vitamins and minerals like vitamin C, vitamin K, and manganese. And vitamin K, for those who are not aware, is potassium. Number two, they are high in fiber. Number three, they may boost brain health. Now look at some of the health benefits of blackberries. Other, as we go deep into, those are some of the, those are the three main uh benefits we're gonna look at we're gonna go deeper look at more wow in the head all this time we're gonna be more wow hello hello hi my name is sam with bas insurance how are you doing today i'm good i don't need it i don't need uh insurance Berries are sweet yet tart. Blackberries are sweet yet tart, and they are summer a summer staple. But the benefits of these berries go well beyond their yummy taste. Blackberries have impressive health benefits. We discussed three of them. And we're going to go deeper. They're packed with vitamin C, as we explained. Just one cup of raw blackberry has thirty point two milligrams. Of vitamin C. That's half the data recommended value. Vitamin C is integral to collagen formation in bones, connective tissue, and blood vessels. 
Vitamin C may also help you heal wounds, regenerate the skin, and battle free radicals in the body. Vitamin C will help you absorb iron, shorten the common cold, prevent scurvy, and more research is, but more, more research is needed. But some studies suggest vitamin C helps reduce the formation of cancer causing substance, substances in the body. Vitamin C acts as an antioxidant, which may also reduce oxidative stress in the body that can lead to cancer. Number two, they are high in fiber. Most people don't get enough fiber in their diet. A low fiber diet has been linked to digestive problems like bloating, constipation, and stomach pain. And according to a 2013 study, not getting enough fiber may increase your risk of heart disease. A high fiber diet may help you. So adding blackberries to your diet will help you with your fiber needs also. Blackberry reduce cholesterol, promote regular bowel movements, control blood sugar levels by slowing the rate of sugar absorption, help you lose weight by making you feel fuller longer, provide, provide fuel to nourish healthy gut bacteria. One cup of raw blackberry has almost eight grams of fiber. Number three, as we stated, is a great source of vitamin K. Of potassium. Vitamin K of potassium is the reason why you don't bleed profusely when you cut yourself. It helps you. It helps your blood count. Vitamin K also plays a role in bone metabolism. Vitamin K deficiency may lead to bone staining and bone fractures. It may cause it may cause easy bruising, heavy muscle bleeding, and blood and stool in the urine. Just one cup of raw blackberry provides almost 29 micrograms. Over one third of the daily recommended value of vitamin K. If you take blood stainers, make if you take blood stainers, make sure to eat a consistent number of foods high in vitamin K, like blackberries, green leafy vegetables, soybeans, and fermented dairy products. Number four, blackberries. I'm sorry, blueberries. Sorry, blackberries. Not blueberry, but blackberries are high in mang mang manganese. You don't hear as much about manganese as other minerals, but it's vital to healthy bone development and a healthy immune system. It also helps your body metabolize carbs, amino acids, and cholesterol. Like vitamin C, manganese plays a key role in the formation of collagen, and the enzymes that help ma ma manganese form collagen Prolidase also helps wounds heal properly. Manganese may help prevent osteoporosis, manage blood sugar levels, and reduce epileptic, epileptic seizures. One cup of raw black berries contain 0.9 milligrams of manganese, almost half the daily recommended value. Keep in mind, though, that too much manganese may be toxic. You don't like to get too much manganese in food amounts, though unless you have a condition that prevents your body from eliminating ex ex excess manganese, and like chronic liver disease or uh, pneumonia. But if you don't have chronic liver disease or, or pneumonia, I'm sorry, if you don't have chronic liver disease, uh, anemia, not, not, not pneumonia, uh, uh, anemia. If you don't have chronic liver disease, like anemia, then you should be fine with your daily amount of manganese coming from your food. So eat the blackberries, get your manganese. Number five, may boost brain health. Eating berry fruits like blackberries may improve brain health and help prevent memory loss caused by aging according to a review of research in the Journal of Agriculture and Food Chemistry. The review concluded that Antioxidants in berry fruits help fight free radicals and all of how brain neurons communicate. This may help reduce brain inflammation, which can lead to cognitive and motor issues common with aging. Number six, 
help support oral health. According to a 2013 study, you may want to add blackberries to your daily dental regimen. The study found blackberry extracts has antibacterial and anti-inflammatory abilities against some types of bacteria that cause oral diseases. Researchers, contact, researchers caution more studies needed, but suggest blackberry extract may help prevent and control gum disease and cavities. Now look at, let's go over some of the blackberry nutrition information. Blackberries are a great option to satisfy your sweet tooth if you want to lose weight or if you're on a low-carb eating plan. One cup of raw blackberries has only 62 calories, one gram of fat, and only 14 carbs. This makes them easy to add to a healthy eating plan. Black, blackberries also have a low glycemic index coming in at 25. Glycemic index ranks how carb-containing foods may impact your blood sugar for your blood glucose re response. A rating, of, a rating of 55 or lower is considered less likely to spike blood sugar levels. A glycemic load takes into account the, the glycemic index as well as the grams of carbohydrates in a typical serving. The GL is considered to be more accurate, be a more accurate assessment of how a food can impact blood sugar. Blackberry's GL is only four, which is very, very low. So, if you try, if you're trying to lose weight and you have that sugar craving, you should have you some blackberries. Keep your keep you some blackberries on hand to, to uh, snack on. And as we talked about in our Previous video and, uh, along this line dealing with berries, blueberries, strawberries, also good to have on hand to munch on. So have, get get some berries, munch on the berries if you have that sweet tooth, craving sugar, eat some berries. And along with craving, uh, satisfying that sweet tooth, they will help you in all kind of areas concerning your health. So if you want to find out more about berries, as I said, we have a link to our previous video dealing with the subject in the description box. So click the like button, subscribe to the channel, and um, hope, you're be, hope you're being healthy, taking care of yourself. Remember that as, as a man, as a man thinking, so is he. If a person, if I think it, therefore I am. So try to keep positive thoughts in your mind. Keep focused on what you want. And until next time, Peace.